school. I like Gresham in primary school because the teachers make it fun to learn and they're really good people. I like being at Britain because I could achieve what I want. This is our film about the work we have made for the Olympics. The Olympics are coming to our city very soon and we wanted to get involved to show our support. When we started the Big Lottery Funded project we had two aims in mind. Firstly to do something that reflected the Olympic values and would have a legacy from the London Olympics and secondly to get parents and children more involved in projects together. We allocated one different value to each year group and they were going to do some artwork to reflect that value and then hopefully bring that value into their work and their everyday life so we can leave a legacy from the Olympics that we've had here in London. What are you looking forward to the Olympics? I'm looking forward to the Olympics actually coming to my own hometown because I actually live here and it's like a great experience and I think it's going to only be once in a lifetime for me. I would imagine myself as Usain Bolt because he's a really fast sprinter and I would like to be like him one day. I'm looking forward to uh, the 500 meter sprint. The gymnastics. The 100 meter. The um, swimming event. 200 meter sprint. I'm looking forward to the 100 meters so I can see if anybody can beat you single. I'm learning about determination and inspiration and how uh, I can use it in my everyday life. I like running. And I'm down to see who the fastest man is. See my favourite athletes. I am very excited and I want to see who's the champion for 2012. Usain Bolt, Dwayne Chambers, Larry Chike, Rebecca Addington. I feel very proud that the Olympics are in London. It being in my hometown. Because it's in London and I live there. I'm basically looking forward to um, watching how they swim and how I can improve on my swimming. I'm looking forward to the crowd because um, if, the, if we didn't have the crowd then the athletes would have been able to do their best. The Olympic values were courage. Courage is being brave and doing something that you're nervous about. Respect. Respect means when you treat everyone nicely. Excellence. Excellence is being the best as it could be. Inspiration. Inspiration means that you have ideas to keep you going. Equality. Equality means everybody is equal and everybody gets along. Determination. Determination means keep on trying and never give up. And friendship. Friendship is everyone makes everyone happy. Art Star came to our school during the holidays to do some work with us. So we made some really wicked art. My name's Debbie, uh, Debbie Dean, and I'm manager with a company called Art Start, which is a community arts organisation based in Edmonton, North London. My name's Sam, and I've been working for Art Start for about five years now. Art Start is a registered charity, and we carry out lots of projects with local community and schools. We were approached by Bretton to work on this project, which is obviously to celebrate the, uh, the Olympics year. Our brief was to create artwork that's going to go around the school, which would leave a, a legacy in line with the Olympic Games. Each year group made artwork to go with each Olympic value. We had to assign an art form to that value. For example, year five value was respect and the art form we assigned to it was textiles. We ended up making large bunting pieces, which they each did, and they had to come up with a word which kind of best represented their, sort of their personality, but a word that described them. We made a bunting and we had to make it about ourselves and what we thought we were good at and what we thought we were. So I chose honourable. It had to match with the Olympics, so as a picture, I done the Olympics. Mum and a boy in my class, his mum came in and helped. The Olympic values that we based our art was courage. We dressed the man who came for the Olympics and this is what we came up with. We had to make the name, which was a mutant Max. As you can see here, he's got his, his axe, which gave him the name. We used rope for effect on his legs and fabric on his hands. Plastic for the hat. A lot of parents came and worked with the children, so that was very much a family-based activity. They 
actually created some Olympic rings and also using a lot of the, the words. So the values were actually done in mosaic words and they're going to be displayed uh, in their playground area and probably throughout the school as well. The reception children, a lot of their parents came and worked with them and they decorated some flower pots so they're going to plant seeds and grow things so hopefully you know they're, they're producing something that's going to have some legacy and, and lasting value. And going on from that, what the good that's come out of that is that the parents have actually requested their own workshop. The Year 6 project involved body image, self image and the value of courage is more about encouraging them to be themselves and not you know trying to be something that other people think they should be. Human Utopia came into our school during the half term to run a harmony camp. Hi I'm Ben, uh, we're from Human Utopia. We run motivational workshops around the country. We're a social enterprise that help young people. These are the core values that we're going to focus during next week because the Olympics are coming. Who wants to be a part of something special? Who thinks that they can work for the team? They taught us about honesty, awareness and responsibility. I'm just going to say to you, are you being honest with each other right now? Then you've got to tell me whether you are or not. I'm going to say to you, were you aware of how you made him feel? We wanted our workshops to be fun, but also very educational for the young people. We wanted to bring in our core values and the Olympic core values. We tried doing this by running activities where they're going to have to be honest, aware and responsible with each other. We played lots of Olympic games and activities. I've enjoyed the fun activities and what Brent taught us today. I'm enjoying all the games and the activities that's going on. I'm happy because um, I think it's a great opportunity for my child and it keeps him happy and active. Well, I think it's good to get the kids to be creative and work together as they create their friendship. The values bring them together. They get a better understanding of each other. Thank you for watching our film. We hope to see you again soon. Bye.